Chinese actress Liu Yifei has drawn Disney's live-action Mulan remake into the political drama already engulfing Hong Kong. The actress who plays the title character Mulan has publicly come out in support of the Hong Kong police force. The comment, made on social media platform Weibo, kind of like a Chinese Twitter, drew in the ire of protesters in Hong Kong. They're now calling for a boycott of the Disney remake, which is slated for release in 2020. The hashtag Boycott Mulan is now trending on Twitter. We know we don't normally cover political stories like this, but we at IGN felt it was important to bring this to your attention, as it may affect the content that you care deeply about. To bring a little context on what's going on and why this is a big deal, here's a quick overview of the situation in Hong Kong. As you may or may not know, Hong Kong is a special administrative region of China, which basically means it's part of China, but is self-governed with its own laws, currency, system of government, etc. Hong Kong used to be a British territory, but was returned to China in 1997. But with the stipulation that the territory remain democratic and free from direct Chinese control for 50 years. So earlier this year, the Hong Kong government introduced a bill that would allow Hong Kong prisoners to be extradited to mainland China, where they would face Chinese law, not Hong Kong law. This was seen as a slippery slope due to the nature of what the Chinese government would consider a crime. Some experts say that their record of respecting civil liberties is spotty at best. This has spurred many Hong Kong citizens into action, resulting in sometimes violent protests over not just the extradition law that have gone on for 10 weeks and counting. Back to the world of entertainment, what does this mean for you, the worldwide IGN audience? The Mulan remake is one of Disney's higher profile projects. The Asian market is huge business for them, particularly in China, and it would benefit Disney to not take sides in political issues like the one in Hong Kong. However, with the hashtag Boycott Mulan picking up steam in countries like Japan, South Korea, and Taiwan, three countries which also have their share of issues with the Chinese government, it could lead to plenty of bad press for Disney and possible loss of income for those regions. Disney films usually do big business in China. Avengers Endgame, for example, pulled in more than $600 million in China alone, according to Box Office Mojo. And in case you didn't realize, Mulan is a distinctly Chinese story. Disney has yet to comment on the situation, though IGN has reached out for an official statement. Many on social media have expressed disappointment with Lou's comments, with one Twitter user pointing out the irony that, quote, Mulan is fighting for the defenseless peeps and Lou Yifei is supporting Hong Kong brutality. Hashtag boycott Mulan. Lou does have her supporters with one user on Weibo saying, believe in the government, believe in the Chinese central government, believe in the country. She's not the only celebrity to speak out on their political views. Jackie Chan, a native Hong Konger himself, was blasted on social media for what some considered his pro-China views. We'll continue to follow the story as it develops. For more gaming and entertainment news, check back with us on the next episode of IGN Now. Gamescom is the biggest gaming event on Earth, and IGN at Gamescom Now is bringing it to you live all week long. We've got exclusive gameplay, demos, cosplay, esports, and so much more. If you can't be here in person, IGN at Gamescom Now is the next best thing. IGN Live at Gamescom is presented by Alienware. Alienware. We're game.